It was in the news with Susan Kiprono. A lady in Buruburu has stabbed her lover to death because of an SMS she saw in his phone. She then turned the knife onto herself. She's fighting for her life in hospital as we speak. Can we be honest about something? You're hiding something, guys. It's a fact. The moment you put a PIN number, there's something in there you're hiding. Why don't you just delete all the controversial stuff? Why are you keeping evidence in your phone? He'd be alive today if he just used to delete. Condolences to his family, by the way. What is this, Aleona? It, it, it was something so serious. She killed that nigga. Listen to this man here justifying locking his phone. But in a simu in the bank, your wife can clean your M-Pesa, M-Shwari, lock account, hata KCB M-Pesa account, mtu wakai na yake, yangu ndiyo bank, staki bibi mkora, hakia <laughs> nani. What is the craziest thing you've seen in your partner's phone? That's what I want to know this morning. What is your spouse hiding that you've discovered on their phone? What is wrong with your spouse going through your phone? Eh. Usianze yo. No. Not for another day. No, no. That's a part of the truth. I'm going to say that. Yo, kwanza. First of all, what is this, Aleona, amba inaeza fanya muto kudunge kisu? What is this? Seriously. Someone has died here. It's a very serious thing in Baka Kukwa News. Everywhere. What is Mark about? If you're going to... Manga Manga. Yes. Hmm. Kill the evidence. You, 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 that's not the issue. The issue is Simweako, which we never touch. Hi yangu, ninini na kuwasha pilipili na kuwasha nini ndio touch. Wait, ata ikipiga, ikipiga, that's why inajiandikaga missed call. I'll call back. Wacha nayo. Wacha nayo. Why are you so defensive? Wacha na na simu za watu wewe. Kila muru wakaya na simu yake. Hello? I'm on in my now. Yes. You're well? I'm well. Hey, okay, I'm just shocked by the act of that woman. Yeah. But today, for the first time, I'll not side with women. Yeah. Mm. My late father in law taught me something. Yeah. And in Yambia, hmm. Okay, for the next two cuckoo in a hula, eh? How can I pull a cuckoo? Eh? Cuckoo in a hula, nyoka in a hula, you know, millipede, centipede. It just is a lot of crap. So it's not that, and the meat is very sweet. Yeah. So if you go looking for trouble, you hundred percent of the time you'll find trouble. I agree. Women's intuition is way off the radar. When I'm here, I'm to feel there's something going down. Yeah. Most, most, ninety-nine uh, percent of the time there's something going down. If you. But I also advise them. Yeah. To just keep off. I'm telling you, there is nothing good that is going to come out of you taking somebody phone because they will find out. They will find something, and I always ask women if the man decided to check her phone, is she a hundred percent sure that she will not find something? Because they are not catiwa. They are not to messages and a reply and a giggle. So, Babu, makes you feel good about yourself. It it shows you that you are uko. You know. Yeah. So, women should just desist from checking their men's phones. It is his phone and it is my phone. If the, if the wheel was to be turned around and it was me being stopped, every time I put my phone down, somebody is on my phone trying to see what it is that I am doing. Yeah. I don't think women would be happy. Because actually, they're actually worse than men. Trust me. I think. So, we should just desist from checking men's what is phones. What is there? I can <laughs> what is what is in there? But I don't know what is in there. 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 So, you know what is in there? Yes. Yes. Okay. But I don't know what is in there. Let me support you. Yes. I'm with you. Mm. Okay. Thank, all right, thank, thank you. you. Thank you very much. Okay. Why don't you have the final word, eh? How of a cent of all revenues collected? 
is also urging teachers to consider the children and end the ongoing strike and give the relevant have the final word morning yes yeah i would like to contribute to this topic you're talking about this morning Karibu. how can somebody say that their phone is private what is more private than my own body if we can share our bodies what is more private than that Bus. if your, your phone is private then my body is private too you keep your phone i keep my body and then saying that uh, what you don't know will not kill you my friend it will mm. kill you faster than you know it mm. true you should not get if you don't get to know this man is cheating very early you will get your HIV in the process if you don't know that you have HIV won't you die of it you will huh. you will huh. so i don't know what people are talking about like if you, if you don't know you will not kill you it will kill you huh. i must know what is going on in your life huh. and if you have nothing to hide huh. why would you why would you hide your phone huh. like me my phone even if i give my children to play with it i don't mind because i know they not bump into anything uh, yeah i can even give you my phone to stay with it for two weeks i will not worry uh, i will not even have to communicate to anybody not to call me uh, because i have nothing to hide true so if you are clean you will not have to hide anything uh, yeah. are, are you married yes i am do you go through your husband's phone i have to you have to yes because there's a time i got something very incriminating yeah so from that time i cannot trust him i have to get these things very early before they go far so and deal with them currently so you, do you ask him for his phone or you, do you take it while he's sharing i even take it when he's there no and i could pin yes he has but i got out i i i knew it somehow somehow i'm very my eyes are very sharp so when you put that pin when if you're sitting far away from me and see it I will know it. Even those security codes, I know them. So una, unafungua simu na ingia kwa SMSs? Eh. Uh-huh. Have you found anything recently that's incriminating? Yes. Alikuwa uh, from another woman? Yes. And what did he say? Oh, why are you touching my phone? Why is it, you see? Those people usually say, why are you touching my phone? Ah, they can't free. Because if I got somebody with my phone, I wouldn't care. Because I know there's nothing to hide there, you know. Yes. So if you hear somebody saying, "My phone, you should not touch my phone. It is private." There is something they are hiding. How do you wakora? Yeah. How do you wakora? How do you wakora? Mtu mwenye si mukora haizi anza kukuambia tio oh, why are you touching my phone? Because there is nothing you'll find. Like me, I don't mind somebody touching my phone. I even give my children my phone to play with it because they will not find anything. Even if somebody asks me for, I'll give you because I have nothing to hide. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. If you've got nothing to hide, what's the problem? Can't you see here the voice of a dictator? <laughs> <laughs> that is the voice of a dictator. Married to a mercenary. <laughs>